it's Regina and Sabrina, and we're going to be checking out Dimash, Dimash on the singer singing Unforgettable Day. <laughs> We've actually gotten quite a few requests for this one, and there's three versions. We've gotten requests for three different versions, so we're going to be checking them all out. Today, we're going to be checking out the one on the singer, but there's also a behind the scenes, and there's also as well one that he did on, I'm probably going to say this channel wrong, Geiko T Geiku TV. So we're going to be checking that out as well. And y'all, okay, so we've gotten requests for his recent performance on Mass Singer. There's a lot of problem with that. When we went to the link, it's not there. It's like not there because of copyright. So we haven't been able to check it out. So if there's a link where we can watch this or check it out, please let us know. Um, also, we have a request. And it looks like it was to, just recently blocked too. too. So we haven't so, been able to look at it. We also had a request to react to a performance he did with Laura and Ada. And there's about 200 million fan cams. A lot. So, <laughs> a lot. So, someone please feel free to share the links that you're most interested in us checking out because we are really curious about it. And we are going to dive into Unforgettable Day. It's one of the requests. We have lots of Dimash requests. And we're going to see him live soon. Also, yes. we're going to be okay. doing some mini vlogs. So be on the lookout for those because we're going to be vlogging, getting ready to go to New York. Um, we're also going to be doing mini vlogs while we're in New York. And we're going to be doing the concert as well. Well, what we're allowed to do of the concert. We'll see how that goes when we get there. But we're going to we're gonna dive into this, y'all. Let's do it. Unforgettable Day on the Singer. This is one of the versions we're checking out. Not sure there's, that there's, I don't see any captions on this. We're going to kind of just enjoy the music here. Which is easy to do because it's Dimash. Dimash. <laughs> God, that stage is like pure gold. It's been pretty open. This space every time.
I'm so cut off there, Azura. Switches are so effortless. <laughs> there wasn't even a shake on that. None. Look, you said the audience knows it is. That was a pretty long Smile. He does. He did a good job. I'm gonna go ahead and say, out of all the singer performances, and we haven't seen them all yet, out of all the singer performances we've seen him do so far, that has to be the smoothest performance. Very soft. I have heard. It seemed like it like, was it was softer than what I'm what. Okay, when I say soft, because I was gonna, even when he reached some of those high notes in the middle of the song. It was softly done instead of drastically done, which is what right. I'm kind of used to with were... him. But then I'm starting to notice, like, when he takes that earpiece out, it's about to get drastic. <laughs> 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 like, like, you know, because all of a sudden I, I see all these soft points like, and how his voice is like just so melod me me melodic. melodic and beautiful. And then he was hitting these high notes and they were so soft and beautiful. And then he took that earpiece Ear out. Earpiece came out. And, and I'm like, like, okay. It's and coming. then. There it went, you there know, went. and I was like, okay, well, there it is. So, that it was just so well done. It was like, well everything done. was so well controlled in that performance. And one of my favorite things to watch, this going to sound like the oddest thing ever, and I know it, is when a performer closes his eyes when they sing. And he closed his eyes during a moment. And they tell you not to do that, too. I know they tell, they tell you, you not, not to, do, to that, do that. But I hate when they tell people not to do that. And let me tell you why. And Because I, I, I used to perform. I used to sing. When I used to close my eyes too, and I used to get in so much trouble for it. But to me, it's when you're feeling it. It's when you're right in that moment. It is just you and the music. But and you when, see all these competition shows, and that's the one thing they'll point out to each other. Don't, don't close your eyes, don't close your eyes. No, but. that is my favorite thing for an artist to do. When they close their eyes, I'm like, I'm sold. Because I know personally, they're in it. That is it. They're in it. That is, they're, it's they're them, in that music. it's the song, it's the moment, and I'm in that moment with them. When I see those eyes closed, I'm like, I'm right here with you. I'm feeling it. Well, the audience says it too. You'll yeah. see them do it when they close their eyes because they're feeling I it. I love it. That's why I said it might be odd to some people, but I love it when a performer closes their eyes. So I know when it. we go to the concert, when he takes that earpiece out, it's on. <laughs> she's going to be it's like, on. she's going to look for that moment. Y'all, all of a sudden you're going to see the camera turn, like if, we, if they let us but film it. Seriously. going to turn around and go, it came out. It's, it's coming. Came out, because, <laughs> I mean, we've done a lot of reactions to Dimash yeah. so far. And, you know, and I pay attention to everything he does. I pay a lot of attention to his, to his mouth and his vocals and everything, but you when know, that earpiece comes out, it just I've noticed it every time when that earpiece comes out, it's on. It's, it's like he's silently saying, "All going. right, y'all, all right, folks, get ready. Here it's it going. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. Here it comes the here. Here it is. Uh, his voice is stunning. If you do not know who Dimash is, 
I don't know if we said this at the beginning, but I'm going to say it now. Did we? He is a Kazakh performer. And he's phenomenal. With an incredible octave range who completely just takes music and makes you feel it in ways that a lot of artists can't. So he's simply amazing. Look him up. Uh, listen to him. Anything he performs, even when he does his fun numbers, because we've seen some really fun like numbers where he's he's done some covers or he's done some uh, numbers. There was one he wrote uh, that he was danced and he one. danced in it, and it was he like wrapped in one. Uh, he ra- he's wrapped in one. We've seen him do a lot of things, and but the feeling is always the same. You come out of it feeling completely moved, completely just sort Stunned. of overtaken. And he's, he's phenomenal. A very versatile he's phenomenal. Singer. He's very versatile. He yeah. makes you feel things in, in in varying degrees, and it's amazing. So check him out. Please do. And go find this link. There are two more versions of this. We did not have English captions on this, but we felt every bit of that. It was very triumphant. And we're looking forward to seeing the performance again. The behind the scenes is, I think, on the Gloria channel. So it will probably have the translation. So we'll also get to see the lyrics as well. But if you'd like to share translations with us, please feel free to do so in the comments. And also, we're going to be checking out one. Somebody told us we really need to check out Unforgettable Day on uh, Gaku TV. I hope I am saying that name right. It's G-A-K-K-U TV. I'm not so sure. we're going to be checking that out as well. So be on the lookout for that. And be on the lookout. We have Thanksgiving week here next week. So we got lots of family stuff. We are probably going to film some mini vlog stuff too because it's time for us to start packing for New York, y'all. She just got her suitcase. So excited. So be on the lookout for that, y'all. We are so looking forward to it. Thank you so much for watching with us. Bye, Bye. guys.